in this example this figure shows a cubical volume of edge a in a region where an electric field exists which depends on x coordinate as is ax square plus b by 2 and here in this situation we can say if electric field exists in x direction which depends on position coordinates and we are required to find the amount of charge enclosed in this cubical volume and for this cubical volume we can see that as electric field is increasing with x so we can say if this is phase 1 and this is phase 2 then on phase 1 if electric field e1 exists and from phase 2 an electric field e2 is emerging out here we can see that for the plane 2 x coordinate is x coordinate is more than that of phase 1 so e2 is more than e1 so we can see that more flux is coming out compared to the flux which is getting into this cubical region so that implies in this region there must be some additional charge and we can say if q is the enclosed charge in this cube this implies we can use gauss law and uh, we can write that uh, phi which is coming out from phase 2 minus phi which is going in the phase 1 is equal to the net charge and closed by epsilon not this the gauss law we can apply that net flux coming out minus flux going in here we are talking about the magnitude of these electric flux and uh, phi out can be written as uh, e2 multiplied by the area of the space which is a square Minus phi in can be written as e1 multiplied by a square is equals to q by epsilon naught, and uh, this implies the value of enclosed charge can be written as epsilon naught a square multiplied by e2 minus e1, and these electric fields we can substitute by using this expression. As for e1, the value of x coordinate is a, and uh, for e2, the value of x coordinate will be 2a. now if we substitute the values over here you can see it will be epsilon not a square and the value of e2 we can write as a x we can substitute as 2a this will be 4a square so this will be 4a cube so we can write it 4a cube plus b by 2 which is e2 minus we can substitute e1 in which we can substitute x is equals to a so it will be a cube plus b by 2 and if uh, we are subtracting this e1 this will be a cube minus b by 2 so in this situation this b by 2 gets cancelled out and the final result here we can see it will be 4 a cube minus a cube will be 3 a cube so the result will be 3 epsilon not a to power 5 this is the total enclosed charge and that will be the answer to this problem